Hello there, and today you will be able to play The paved paradise put up a parking lot With a pink hotel and a boutique and a swinging hot spot Till it's gone, they pay paradise, put up a parking lot. Mm, yeah, absolutely. What a great song, and what a great way to play it on the ukulele. Wasn't that fun? Actually, I'll put this down for a little bit because. And greetings, by the way, my name is Ben, so nice to see you. To play this song, we have to do something kind of flexible, creative, and really rewarding. We have to change the tuning ever so slightly, of our ukulele. And I'll just pause two seconds. Good, that was all the boring people changing channel. <laughs> so what we need to do, take your ukulele and play G, C, E, A. And don't worry, I'll walk you through all of this. It's well within your, your ability, so not to worry. Now, what we wanna do is tune down the G string to an F. We want a nice fourth when it sounds when it sounds about right this is what we want basically now the G string has to sound like E1 which is the first note of the E string oh not quite there ah there we go and then we want to tune the E string down the one we were just using oh we want to tune it up well oh, mustn't get that mixed up we want to tune the E string up to an F then we have an F, just strumming open strings. And that's perfect because actually Johnny Mitchell, Big Yellow Taxi, she is using open chord, open strumming, open tuning kind of tuning on her guitar. And that enables her to slide up with her index and play major chords all the way across the fret, which is, believe it or not, exactly what we can now do also. Now play this F. Feel free to double check your tuning with a tuner if you're a bit unsure, if something f sounds funny. We've now got F, C, F, A, A, which is what you get for making it till here. We've now tuned the ukulele and by sliding the index all the way up to the fifth fret, slide it, so play and slide to the fifth fret. Basically your thumb is behind accompanying the slide and when you get to the fifth you squeeze a bit so you make sure you stay there or even a bit more and now slide to the seventh fret and now everything open that's kind of the song that's pretty much what you need except what's happening here is I'm adding my ring finger two frets above the index on the C string, on both chords. I've got tabs uh, in the document that goes with this lesson to really accompany you through each bit of this song. But a lot of what I really advise you or really encourage you to do is to feel your own preference and to improvise whatever sounds most groovy to you. Basically, that's the idea. But what we've got is down and then mute by lifting the, the by relaxing the pinching action from the thumb and the index on the fretboard. So down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. And then change, down, up, down, up, down, up. And on the up, down, up, you've already got the ring finger down, which means we've got And then we can play this really cool riff. With these three chords here, you can see the B flat star and the F7. So play an F, B flat star, which is like a G minus six usually, and then an F7, and back to B flat star. So F, B flat star, F7, B flat star, F, 
B flat star F7. And that's what enables us to play effortlessly, effort, really easily the riff that she's playing kind of like that on her guitar. So we just want to go down up 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 and some of them can arrive a bit early. Let's play with the um, F7 and the second B flat star on the way down a bit early which means they land on the four of the chord before and it'll be like this one two three four one two Feel free to improvise here. This is really when you can just move between these chords with a constant strumming here and make some arrive on the up, make some arrive on the down. That's really what you want to improvise with. Um, and there's a couple of indications in the tabs of suggestions of how you can play this. That's kind of the riff. Now let's play the verse number one. Anytime you see B flat or C written down, you want to slide up to them with your index. Not like this, playing all across five, but like this, like we did at the beginning. Now what you want to do now, a great song by the way, what a song, what a song. I can't believe it didn't stop the use of DDT. It's that good. Doesn't make sense. Great song. <laughs> They pave paradise. All right. They pave paradise. And again, slide up again, because the B flat has got a slash, which means there's two of them. And if you play again a B flat, if you play it again, you slide again. You play B flat, you slide. That's the rule. And here on this F, that's where the riff happens. With a pink hotel, and now slide, go back down and slide up to the C, which is seventh fret. D, F, and here a bit of riff again. And then in the chorus, we're going to be strumming like this. We've got the um, B flat that we had, B flat star, but two frets up. And that's actually our F5 major 7, because there's no third, but there's a fifth and a major. Anyway, it's this chord. It's really easy. Don't it always seem to go that you, and then two down here, B flat start. Don't know what you've got till it's everything open, gone. Slide up for the normal B flat, remember? Pave paradise and put up a parking lot. Rip! Okay, now you've got the idea, let's play verse number two, not too fast. Remember to slide up on each new chord. One, two, three, four. They took all the trees, put them in the tree museum. And they charged the people a dollar and a half just to see them. to slide up. What you want to notice in the chorus is that we've got um, on the second line a B flat star which is just this one. Don't know what four beats and then another one but it's in italic which means half as many which means two beats. So four plus two is four, four plus two yes six six thanks six so you've got six beats in total of B flat star at that point in time and then two beats of F so it goes like this, that you, one, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, and then slide up. One, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, right? That's really handily written here. Yes, you're welcome. Let's, let's do the chorus again. Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you've got till it's gone. They pave paradise, but I put you in the parking lot.
Okay, and now verse number three, I will be playing it at full speed to show you what your song can sound like. Hey, farmer, farmer, put away the DDT now. Give me spots on my apples, but leave me the buds and the bees, please. Don't they always seem to go? You don't know what you've got till it's gone. They paved paradise, put up a parking lot. can actually uh, also use the little thing we had in the intro there sometimes in the chorus if you want if you like it you can add your ring finger now why doesn't it quite sound like her live version actually because she's half a tone a semitone higher so instead of having F C F A she's actually got I'm, I came prepared. Uh, she's actually, she's actually got F, sh F sharp, C sharp, F sharp, B flat, or A sharp. And so it's going to sound a bit higher. Late last night, I heard the screen door slam, slam. And a big yellow taxi took away my old man. Hey, thank you so much for watching. The document is in the description. And of course, support is always appreciated. Um, so feel free to click on the thumb that says, hey, nice. Or to click on the thumb that says, so see you soon for more, everybody. And have a wonderful, wonderful day, night. Delete as applicable. See ya.